people, I got another box to unbox. So you better get ready. Cause come, it's I'm a oh. oh oh god. Oh my life's going nowhere. Alright people, what's up everyone and welcome to another Gore's Recent Game Pickups video, episode 59, we're almost at 60, one more episode, then 40 more, then we had 100, that's how math works. So anyway, I got another box to unbox in this episode, and it is a lot. I got some in my eye, oh no, it's okay, eh, eh, okay, I'm, eh, wait, oh, wait, hold on. I'm good. All right, so I got a box to unbox. I'm excited. You excited? I hope you are. I'm not starting this video over. I don't give a shit. This big old box I got right here. Here we go. Look at this. Oh, bam. Oh, it's big. It's it's nice. It's heavy. It's nice. Uh, and I'm going to be unboxing this baby for you in this episode. It is a lot of PlayStation 2 games. I can't remember how many exactly, but uh, I ordered this like a week ago, and it was like, it was just $20, and it was a pretty good deal for the most part. I mean, nothing too crazy in it. It, besides a couple of games uh, besides that I also picked up a few uh, a few other lots on uh, offer up and I'll show you those not a crazy not a crazy uh, episode but uh, I should have another one up very soon after this one too because I should be getting more stuff in the coming days so let's get to it all right let's open this this box that almost fell I got right here feels like games so let's open it okay where's my knife I don't have my knife I don't have my knife you know what I don't need a knife you know why I got man power okay I need a knife wait hold on wait I, I got it wait huh, I'll, find, I'll find I'll find a week I'll find a weak spot I'll find a week I, I, I found a weak spot don't worry about it I got it I got it watch this watch this watch this strike <laughs> <laughs> Oh, watch, watch. <laughs> Get over it. All right, so I, I got I got it open. I had to, I had to turn the camera off because I had to, I couldn't. I had to go Super Saiyan. All right, I'm not gonna lie. You know this fat little body had to go Super Saiyan. <laughs> a little. Uh, and it came in a nice little LeBron, like the LeBron shoes box, which is a, which is cool. It's a big ass uh, shoe box, by the way. Size nine kidding me this is huge look how big this is compared to my head it's big so anyway <sighs> all right let's see what's in here anyway like i said there's ps2 games you already knew that but uh all right they look like uh they're packed pretty nicely can't remember how many is in here but you know we'll get to it obviously <laughs> we'll figure we'll figure it out um all right so first game first is marvel ultimate alliance that is complete i'll look later at the discs the important ones I'll look at the disc, but uh, the ones that are lesser value, I, I, I'll, I'll check later. Um, but anyway, it looks like it's in pretty good condition. The uh, case does not close, though, I don't think. No, it's not closing. All right, so, but well, it looks good. You know, don't have it. Add it to collection. Uh, Onimusha Warlords. PS2 game. Uh, of course, the Xbox One and PS4 version just came out, and I really... Really was surprised by how well this held up. I played this game almost 20 years ago. That's crazy. It came out, what, 2001? To almost 20 years ago. I rented it from a Blockbuster, I remember. I really enjoyed it. And I remember, actually, as a kid, and I, I, probably, I could probably say this about any game back when I was a kid because I was a little pussy, but uh, I just remember this game actually kind of creeping me out with all the demons and stuff and had the same control scheme and camera as uh, Resident Evil, so it was supposed to be a Resident Evil game, actually, so... I believe that's true. But anyway, Onimusha, uh, it is complete. Uh, it looks actually pretty good. Actually, this one I want to I want to take a look. Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, I have this as a disc, but I do not have it complete until now. So now I have every Onimusha game, including the Xbox One version. Well, I guess I don't have the PS4 version, so I do have Genma too, which is the Xbox version, which came out with a bunch of other shit and remastered stuff uh this is kind of a throwaway thing suzuki tt super bikes real road racing what oh it's complete <laughs> i don't have it so out of the collection <laughs> 
Disney Pixar cars. Hell yeah. This is complete. Oh wow, these are all complete. They look pretty nice too. Uh, in the in the picture that the guy posted on OfferUp. By the way, this is from OfferUp. Did I mention that? Um, it didn't look like. They look kind of dirty. I don't know why. They just they just looked like they probably weren't. I think it was just because the picture itself wasn't very good. Uh, but they just look like they probably won't be complete or something like that. Or they would have scratches. And I haven't looked at a lot of them. Let's look at cars. Yeah, 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 I'm wondering now. Oh, yeah, that's scratched. Never mind. <laughs> I take it back. <laughs> that one's scratched. That makes me a little worried. Uh, all right. Next is uh, Street Fighter Alpha Anthology, which uh, I don't know if this one actually goes for a little bit. Uh, it is complete. I know a lot of the collections for Street Fighter do not really go for any money. Uh, ooh, that one's scratched too. Oh, that's bad. I don't think that one goes for much anyway. Um, I will definitely have to get that resurfaced before I'll play it. This one I'm worried about because this is the one that's actually worth like 20, 25 bucks. And I actually really wanted this game in my collection. I'm going to look right now. It's complete. So at least that's good. I hope it is not scratched because this one I actually really wanted in my collection. And the 30 bucks I paid for this entire lot uh, after shipping and stuff um, would almost be worth it for this game if it's in good condition. And that is Galactic Wrestling featuring Ultimate Muscle. Hell yeah, remember Ultimate Muscle? Uh, what was the theme song? Oh shit, I forgot what it was. It was like Ultimate Muscle, something, 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 a bunch of shit. I don't remember. <laughs> but uh, I used to like Ultimate Muscle a lot. Um, it looks pretty clean. And it is complete. And the manual looks nice. All right, let's see if the disc looks good. Oh, is it a blue disc too? It is. Oh, it's mint! Yeah, it's mint! You can't tell. I don't even know what I'm showing. Oh, it's got a couple light scratches. Not mint, but compared to what I thought it was gonna look like, I thought it was gonna look like shit. That's staying in the collection, baby. Actually, all of these are staying in the collection so far. Uh, this one feels like it's not in there. Oh, it is, okay. Disney Pictures Bolt, don't care. <laughs> it just doesn't have the manual. Don't even care if it's scratched. All right, next, SmackDown vs. Raw. That's kind of cool to have because I love the SmackDown vs. Raw games, and I don't have this one, so that's kind of cool. I'll take that. Uh, here's some more garbage. Uh, Madden 08. That's complete. <laughs> Look, <laughs> they even knew who gives a fuck, right? They made it in black and white. The manual. They don't even care. Uh, EA is just like, yeah, we can't afford color for this version of the game. Fuck you. <laughs> no color. All right. Fight Night Round 3. I think I have this one. Ooh. Oh, look at this. <laughs> see, see, a, see a trend right there. Um, all right. Move, bitch. Get out of my way. All right. This one I'm pretty sure I do have on PS2. The Sims. A lot of these are complete. I mean, not all of them, but uh, so far pretty good. No, I'm not going to lie. This one I do not have. Um, so I will be adding to the collection. Rebel Raiders. You do not think it's worth anything, but it's cool. Now this one I think is a mystery. I don't think uh, he said what this was in the description. Let's see what it is. Rule of Rose. <laughs> MLB the show. MLB 07 the show. Fuck. Is there another black? No, there isn't. No. I was hoping there was another black box one. Uh, SmackDown vs. Raw 2006. Used to play this all the time. Love that game, actually. Uh, <laughs> Pimp My Ride. Oh, wait, I didn't check. It's complete. Wait. It's complete, but it has the SmackDown vs. Raw 1 manual. So at least I have that game complete. I actually have this game, so actually that kind of works out. I used to love that game. I used to play the general manager mode all the time. So good. Anyway, Pin My Ride Street Racing. I actually have this disc only. I played this for Shit Games Done Quick, and I got a lot of shit for this one for some reason. I guess people really like this game. Alright. <laughs> if you say so. Uh, this one is... What the fuck? Alright, it says Tony Hawk's Project 8 on the GameStop case, but it's actually SmackDown vs. Raw 2007. I might as well just get SmackDown vs. Raw 2007 now. Bam! Because it does come with it. And, uh, oh, inside is SmackDown vs. Raw 2008. I feel like it's I'm, I'm getting like a practical joke played on me. I'm going to keep opening cases. It's going to be like the next year. Like, I got 2008's cases. I have 2009 in it. Uh, the... Okay, well... At least I have 2000. I do. I do have 2007. It's just in the Tony Hawk days. All right. Blitz the league, which is a pretty fun little uh, 
football game. I had to make sure it was in there um, <laughs> before I started talking about it. But it's actually a pretty fun little football game. Uh, the first and the second one are both rated M. As you can see, it says rated M right there. Uh, it was part of the Blitz League, I mean Blitz uh, series that uh, used to be like arcadey football, and that's still an arcadey football game. But as the title would or the rating would suggest, it's definitely more uh, <laughs> more mature. It, it's pretty immature for the most part, but uh, I, I really enjoyed it for it being so different than most uh, football games. Uh, next is The Incredibles. Whatever. Uh, Smuggler's Run, which I actually do not have, surprisingly. I don't have the second one either. It is complete. Again, a lot of these, are, there's going to be nothing really crazy here. Uh, NBA Live 07. No manual. Okay. Uh, uh oh, Need for Speed Carbon. It isn't there. <laughs> Black and white. EA just didn't give a fuck anymore. And the last one is Transformers: The Game. Ooh, this case looks questionable. Uh, it's in there though. I gotta look to see how badly they're scratched before I give that guy a good review. But for like twenty bucks plus shipping, I think the shipping was twelve, so thirty-two bucks. I think if I if I remember, I think I I. I I, 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 uh, I sent him a offer for 18 so I might have got it for 30 altogether but not too bad I could t I could probably put everything I don't want in a bundle and sell on eBay for at least like 20 bucks and keep everything that I do want um, I have to look and see if the discs are good but I was really happy to see this one end up being in good condition so that made me a little happy uh not the best bundle but you know what couldn't couldn't pass it up especially i get a lebron james uh shoe box i guess are they called lebrons i don't know i don't know shoes i don't i know video games <laughs> i know video games so all right let's uh let me organize it for myself so be easier let me count them too just real quick Whoa, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-four. I think I might have miscounted actually. Uh, <laughs> I think I, 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 let me do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twenty, 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 twenty. Oh, I miscounted. Fifty-eight, fifty-eight games. There you go. I got it. <sighs> Fucking hate my life. All right, so on these fucking future landfill here i'm just looking at it. i'm trying to move it out of the way so i could i have room okay i'm good all right so what should i do next uh you know what let's do some more ds games i got some good ds um purchases definitely some good ones some great ones actually i should have started off with this because this is definitely better than <laughs> the ps2 lot i'm not gonna lie um there was somebody selling a lot of DS and 3DS games, and it was a damn good deal. It was like, uh, I think $25. Um, and uh, let me take a swig real quick, and then I'll continue. Give me one minute. Oh, it's like acid. It tastes good. All right. So, <laughs> for $25 plus $5 shipping, uh, she was originally hesitant on shipping it to me because I think she put it up on OfferUp as like a pickup thing but she put shipping on mistake you know she wanted it as a pickup thing but i told her i'll add like five bucks extra uh make it 30 plus the five dollars shipping and she said okay and i got a great deal i got a great deal here uh these are all ds and 3ds games they are not in the cases but uh you can see from the first one right here that it is a good deal this game alone sells for 25 bucks so it's pokemon black version 2 can you see it stop stop just come on focus don't focus on my face. Focus on this. Oh, sorry. I'm trying. Uh, next is... What the fuck? Littlest Pet Shop Friends. Of course. The classic. Goatee right there. <laughs> Whatever year it came out. Uh, this one, I actually wanted this game ever since uh, it came out on the DS. And I never got it. This and the Resident Evil game, I still have yet to get. Uh... These are two games I really want on my DS, but at least this one I do have, just card only, and that is Ultimate Mortal Kombat, which is just, you know, it's Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3, I'm pretty sure, with some added things, like a, I think I had like a, like a puzzle game or something like that, I'm not really sure, actually, I don't remember anymore, <laughs> it's been a long time since that came out, uh, and another copy of New Super Mario Bros, there you go, right there, that's easily worth 30 bucks, but... 
I got 3DS games too. Look at this little stack of 3DS games. What could be in here? There's five of them. Could be something good. Well, first of all, we got Animal Crossing. New Leaf, I believe. Right? That's still a $15 game card only. A Link Between Worlds. It's another $15 game. Super Smash Brothers for the 3DS. That's like $15, $20 right there. The Legend of Zelda Triforce Heroes. You kidding me? Come on. I don't even have that game. And uh, oh, I ended it a little weak here. The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Which on the other consoles it goes for quite a bit. On 3DS it goes for about 10 bucks. So right there. If I sell these all together, I could sell these for at least like 50, 60 bucks. Uh, I'm not even going to lie to you. I already sold these, actually. <laughs> I sold these today. I sold these along with a copy of Pokemon Omega Ruby that I bought a, a few weeks ago that I wasn't selling on eBay. So I just looped that in with this stack and I sold it for 70 bucks. So, bam, $70 right there. Technically, let's say maybe like 50, 60 dollars because I added the Pokemon. So, from that lot already I made some money back and I, I still have Pokemon Black version 2, another copy of New Super Mario Brothers, uh, the Goaty, Louis Pet Shop. I like that. That was like the only one that was like, just didn't fit. Like, everything else was like, like worthy of being in a collection. And then you, you know, Louis Pet Shop, <laughs> it's so weird. Uh, I also got another DS lot. This one isn't too great when it comes to the games, but it came with two things that are DS related or DS not related that's that's the right word um that I had to buy it it was $15 plus $5 shipping so 20 bucks all together I could sell one of these things for like 30 bucks right there only problem is there's a couple there's issues with them and I'll show you in a minute but let me show you the games the games are definitely nothing to write home about these are uh just the worst I'm not even gonna say <laughs> these are garbage titles uh first is Little League World Series Baseball. If you can't see a title, whatever. Um, <laughs> the Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. The fuck? Tipton Trouble? I never watched Sweet Life, so please tell me in the comments. Actually, please don't tell me in the comments. Meet the Robinsons. People are going to tell me in the comments. Tipton's the bad guy. He's like, uh, he's a man. I don't know. Fucking know. Scholastic, my amusement park. Scholastic. I don't know why I said it like that. Uh, lovely. What the fuck? Lovely Lisa and Friends. I don't give a shit. And, and Friends. The sports collection from Ubisoft. It's a collection of sports. I don't know. Don't care. Uh, Alright, this one might actually be worth a little bit. SpongeBob SquarePants, Nicktoons, Globs of Doom. There you go. You care? You don't care. Uh, and, oh, well, this is, this is another goatee right in my hands. Paws and Claws, Pet Vet Healing Hands. That's a pretty long title. I think kids have the uh, attention span to read the rest of that title. Oh, fuck. Unless you put Fortnite in it. Alright, so I dropped one of the goatees. All right, so I got a stack of goatees right there. <laughs> I, To be fair, I could probably sell that stack of games that I do not want for probably around 15, 20 bucks right there. And there's people that do want them, and you could sell those games probably for like two bucks a piece. And, I, and there was like, what, 10? I think I, I wasn't really counting, so no, eight. So I could at least make most of my money back. But the reason why I bought a lot is because of these two things. One right here is an action replay for the Nintendo DS. These actually go for a little bit, surprisingly. Right there, yeah, looks pretty cool, right? And this one, this one I'm hoping I can get it to work. There's something wrong with it. I guess there's something with the action replays where it has a glitch where I don't know what's going on with it, but I guess there's like an Easter egg or something like that where it, whenever you put it in the DS or the DSi, this is an action replay DSi. There you go. Um, for some reason, it, it registers as the Game & Watch collection. I don't know why. I never used Action Replay. I was more of a Game Shark guy anyway, but I definitely didn't play Action Replay with my DS. Never used cheats at all on the Nintendo DS, especially not Nintendo DSi, considering I didn't have one. <laughs> so I only had a DS and a DS Lite, um, and then 3DS, obviously. So uh, I have two Action Replays. I 
think there's something wrong with this one. I think I could still sell it for like 20, 30 bucks. Uh, I could sell this one. This one works perfectly fine. I could sell that one for 20, 30 bucks. Um, so good deals right there. Tell me if you use Action Replay. I looked it up and people had like various ways to fix them, but I think you also need the disc and the cord, which didn't come with either or, because you need a cord to put the codes into this. The disc gives you the codes. You have to put it on a computer. It's I remember when GameShark was simple. You freaking put in the thing and bam, codes. What's up? <laughs> Pretty sure that's how it works. Anyway, I don't remember anymore. Um, but uh, I think that's about it for this episode at least. Um, so that's it. DS lots, PS2 lots. I know this is a weird episode, but <laughs> I don't know. I had freaking like four hours of sleep. You don't even want to know the kind of pain I endured during the night. Um, just a huge headache throughout the night, so I could not go to sleep. And I'm just, I am a tired little boy. So I, I apologize that this is a very weird episode. But uh, I hope you enjoyed it anyway. So, kind of short, but you know what? I got, I got some good stuff, I think. So, you know what? Might be weird, but I got good stuff. Action replays, Black Version 2, Mario's. I got PS2 games, Ultimate Muscles, 3DS games. It's a good time. It's a good time to be alive. So, uh, anyway, that's it. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. And, of course, until next time, I love you. You know I do. Goodbye. See you later. Arrivederci. Get the fuck out of my room.